you basically don't really improve anything. Okay, you try and get maximum strength, maximum power, maximum aerobic endurance. You can't. Okay, we've all seen athletes who basically suck at everything. And they're not really good at anything. And that's not exactly what you want in an athlete. You want to be really good at what you need to be good at. So next. So this is how I basically do it. This is how I approach training. This is, uh, you know, take it for what it's worth. This is how I look at my athletes. Okay, I basically develop a profile that I consider optimal for performance. The way that I do that is by testing lots of guys and separating out. Here's the profile of really high performing athletes. Here's a profile of guys that suck, right? What is the difference? Okay, so then I get a new guy and I've got the most information, obviously on MMA, but I've got a ton on football and soccer and a few others. Um, but you really have to start collecting information on your athletes to figure out why is this guy the best athlete in the field? Why is he have the best vertical jump? Why is he fatigued the, less, the least? Why is he the fastest? Whatever it may be. You have to start looking at the big picture and figuring these things out so that when you test the next guy, you can see where he's lacking and why he's not.